previously on Amore. Glass cup. Break? No? Frying pan. I guess it was just those two then. And now back to... Waiting for something to happen? Sneak a bee! Back with some more Mori. We last left off. We explored through the library of knowledge that is, uh, seems to be Mori's memories and, uh, other, other bits of lore, which was, uh, really interesting, really fascinating. Got to look around his house some more as well. And started theorizing, and I, I finally noticed, or well, I, I post edit, but it, I was, I finally was like, fuck this, all right? I, I never remember when I'm playing it. I'm gonna do it now. And it what, actually wasn't until last episode when we came across the uh, uh, the table with the picture that I was like, oh shit, does that piece of furniture match the spot? It freaking did. I actually did notice too, there was another room in the bottom left, what I think was like one of the side rooms or something, where we also saw that same mark from the, the table. I have a feeling that that was like the original spot the table was at, because it was, it was exactly the same marks that were in the other spot. Like that was where it sat initially until somebody died. I'm thinking Mari. And then they put the table there as a memorial for some time until they decide to move. That's just my guess though. Which that is the case. That is an insane attention to detail. Or it's absolutely fucking window dressing and I'm being ridiculous and I need to calm the fuck down. But seeing as this game is all about tons of little details, so many details that are easy to miss and are seemingly like RNG sometimes, you know? I really wouldn't put it past the game's creator to to actually put something like that in there. Like, cause this, this is the shit that I think creators like this, they just, they fucking get off on this, all right? This is like creators like Toby Fox, creators like Scott Cawthon, who just love to put little tiny details for people who just wanna just dig in so deep to figure out every bit of the lore, which I do like to an extent, right? I, I think my only sort of gripe against that is, again, what I was talking about last episode, where some things are like so hidden, so ridiculously hidden or so easily missable that, I, well, I don't know. Like it just, it's that feeling of like, you, if you want to see everything, you're going to either have to use a guide or have a fucking comment section <laughs> like I do. And when so many of those things are, are hidden behind like either RNG or just that one insanely tiny window of chance, I don't know. like. A part of me is like, that's cool, but then the other part of me is like, man, that's, you're just cutting off so much of your fan base to notice such a, a fascinating detail that would actually really contribute to the lore of the game, you know, to understanding everything. I don't know. I, I just go back and forth on it. I think it's like, it's good to have some of it, but don't make it so predominant. And I did, this game does seem to sort of ride that line for me. But we are now in the uh, underwater section uh, and seemingly the last area of the map here. Seeming, so I don't know if there's like going to be like a new world map we go to or if it's just like now a new events will pop up on the places we've been to. But if we don't go to any other new places, then I don't know. It seems like we could be getting close to the end of this route. Uh, one other thing that actually did also occur to me when I went back to listen to um, the stories that was told about Sonny, right, in the library. One of them brought up how he was about to jump into the water, right, and a spider jumped, got on his shoulder and it freaked him out and he fell in. It seems like that describes potentially where his fear of both drowning and spiders came from. And I guess maybe you could even argue heights. I mean, it seemed like he might have been high, jumping from a high place. Um, but I, I, although I was kind of thinking the heights could have come from if my theory at all is correct that Mario like fell down the stairs or something, could have come from that. Because the thing is, we also just keep seeing Mari, like whenever we see her in those flashes, a lot of times she's walking downstairs. And every time Mari has like a panic attack or like a moment of like, oh fuck, I'm gonna die, right? It's usually him going down these endless stairs. So it seems like a lot of that fear kind of like stems from that. Although I guess, I don't know. I don't know if the, the stairs themselves, the like a fear of heights. I mean, maybe just a fear of falling down them. I don't know. Maybe that's his own separate thing. Though he hasn't really had any problems with stairs here, right? It's not like I'm, a, I ha I'm afraid of steps. <laughs> I'm afraid of violins. Uh, but anyway, last episode, uh, the cool fool said, <laughs> Nico is slowly, day by day, merging with Kokichi in his mind and voice. Soon they will be completely fused into one being named Kel. <laughs> yes, yes, 
I can feel it. Oh, you and I will become one, Nico. No, get out of my head. Get out of my head, Gucci. You and I will become what you were always meant to be. Yes, good. Say it, Nico. No, I don't want to say it. Say it. Say it. Kill. Yeah. We are Kel. <laughs> I do. I feel like this weird kinship with Kel. It's just, I, I just, I like that Kel says all the dumb shit that I'm like pretending is happening. That just gives me such a insane satisfaction. I, can, I can't even describe it, okay? You have any idea where I've been doing this shit for nine years now, right? Nine years on YouTube. And I've been ad libbing crazy bullshit. To finally have a character be like, you know what? I got you, fam. And just start saying the shit that I actually want to say. It means a lot, all right? It hits you hard. So thank you, Kel. Thank you for being that guy in that, <laughs> that that game. And even if we go out and find that apparently Aubrey and Hero are both fucking dead because they realized they were underwater and just freaking drowned, I'm just gonna be glad that at least Kel is still alive. Hell yeah! But anyway, Dick Cool Fool, thank you so much for your <laughs> incredibly true comment. It's that reason you are our comment of the day. And by the way, you guys did give me a few more tips. One thing in regards to Rococo, I actually don't, it isn't based on game time, how long it takes them to finish a painting. All you have to do is basically exit back to the Sprout Mole Village and just walk back in and he'll be done with it. So cool. All right. Uh, I'll have to move forward a bit more with the game so I can actually go back to the woods again. Probably have to find the party members before the fog dissipates, I'm guessing. Oh, and you guys did also confirm that I actually was right in my, my theory that the single space name uh, in the missing uh, memories or like the, the missing names, right? That actually was in fact Sunny slash Amori because the game actually does let you uh, name Sunny whatever you want. That's true, I didn't even think about that. And also the fact that if they were to put uh, fill the blanks as like sunny, right? That would actually be the same number of letters as basil. Ooh, that is, that's a really good point. That actually would have made things really confusing. You know, if, if my theory had actually ended up being right where like basil is, uh, like sunny or something like I was initially thinking that, then that actually would have played really well into that theory of like, well, it could be sunny or basil. That, that actually would have been kind of cool, but I, it looks like it's pretty clear that is not the case. Seems like basil and sunny are completely different people. So one thing I have actually been also pondering sort of off, uh, off camera is why does Amori view basil as like this demon? <laughs> like seemingly in all of these like moments where he's following him, right? And we, and we finally actually got to see like a a uh a portrait for like the dark basil i'm assuming it's basil just because it's got like the similar hair and he has like these evil looking eyes and i'm like why does he see him as like this darkness why is it always like the darkness that seems to be attacking basil and there actually been a few moments where we had like basil standing behind amori and he or looking down at him while darkness is behind him and i'm like why does he see him that way what is the the deal when it seemed like he was so nice and positive before mm, i don't know i want to like <sighs> I've got kind of a very dark theory of what potentially could be what that is insinuating. I'm almost wondering if maybe like Basil goes through periods of just like supreme, like horrible depression and like suicidal thoughts. Cause I mean, clearly this game is going to get there, right? That That's why the warning was there at the start of the game. But it almost makes you wonder if he was like, if he's like someone who is like influencing a Mori or something like, like you should cut yourself or hurt yourself or something to make the pain go away. I don't know. That that would be really fucked up. But I can also see this game going there. Like he's like the dark influence. But like it's so like juxtaposed to again to his seemingly bright and cheerful self. Maybe the death of Mari sent him down a really like fucked up path. Like he was fine and then that shit just like screwed him up. Maybe he's bipolar? Maybe something else I, I don't know i just i just keep wondering why he's seeing basil in this light right and we're not really seeing that with too many other characters i guess you could argue maybe mari that one time but that was more like her her neck was fucked up right and she looked looked messed up but i don't know if he was really seeing her in like a negative light you know after some thought it seems like that shadow is always always following basil right is he like the source of it is it Actually, actually, now that I think about it, when Basil, like the last time we saw Basil, right? And he looked at the picture and he's like, wait a minute, Mari is, right? We saw like this darkness, right? That appeared underneath him. It actually stemmed around him. Yeah. Hmm. Like maybe it did come from him. Did the, the something. It seems like that's what the, like they're generally going with is that that black thing with the eye, right? Is something. 
whenever it appears or that thing with the weird creepy smile like he doesn't know what it is but it's just called something like this this darkness reigns i don't know just that's kind of where my head is at right now like in reality basil is actually like this really bad influence on sunny slash amori but that's again very much a theory because we I have yet to really see basil do anything yet <laughs> you know it's, I, that's i'm just going based off of like quote unquote symbolism and imagery here it could be that maybe it's something that amori and sunny share in right maybe amori was already that way and they bond on their own suffering i i don't know there's i'm still missing way too many way too many uh clues and hints here but just just something i'm thinking about all right anyway uh we're out here oh hey joke joke wall what lies at the bottom of the ocean and twitches a nervous wreck that's fucked up excellent I'll take it. Is this guy like doing a thumbs up or something? Aha, oh, man, that was a gun good joke. What a good freaking joke. I tell you what, that's a good yoke, son. Grain juice. It's not for kids. Toilet ramen. I still want to know what the hell is like. What is the toilet ramen? Is that some inside joke between the creator and some friend? Is there like some joke about ramen being in the toilet that I don't know about? I don't understand. Yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, yes, sir. Yeah, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, affirmative. Yeah, roger that. Yeah, yeah. Now, now I think about it, uh, seeing uh, that one scene, too, where Mori was in the water, right? And we saw Mari reaching out to him. It's possible that he, he said in that one story that Amori was waiting for the brothers to hop in and save him. Maybe it was Mari that actually came in and saved him and not uh, Kel or uh, Hero. Uh, Jorge. Hey, you kids are on vacation. Are you here? Are you one of the staff? With all this construction going on, they can at least invest in some uniforms. Ah, oh, it's nice to finally take a break. Are oh, you from the city too? You look like a couple of city kids. Food is good, but sewage is horrible. Am I right? Or am I right? Hi, Charlene. Hey, no splashing in the pool. Okay, don't do it. Or I'll cut you. What? Nothing. You're pretty sure this pool is haunted. What? <gasps> oh my God, there's a face in it. Just conveniently how the light is shining down. Looks like a weird demon face. Ah, oh, gosh and gosh, your pool is haunted. Oh, fuck. This is going to be some shit. Is this actually a boss fight? Uh-oh. Ghost party. Oh, okay. I was like, oh god, I'm about to get into a fight. I, thought I was about to get into a fight with something again. It's like I only have one party member. It might be Diesel, but uh, I'm not that confident. <sighs> and I see a letter. Uh, welcome to Black Space. This is not gonna fill anything, but I'll take it anyway. Wah wah. Actually, wait, no, it is. What am I talking about? Yeah, yeah, well. Oh, four keys left. Oh, shit. The the words are getting all fucked up looking now as I get more. Okay, so all I'm missing is a W, a T, an S, and a P. So uh, W is in the gut of a whale. A T is in a large bubbly tank. That could be down here. A P is in a water closet. Also could be down here. S within a live shell. These all sound like things that could be down here. There's a hole here. Ooh. I'm gonna start falling again? Yep. Oh shit. <sighs> Give me some more of that dink lore. Oh, this is different. A videotape labeled Amori. A videotape labeled Basil. <gasps> oh, fuck. Uh, hope it's not like you got to pick one and the other disappears. That would suck. Actually, if it did, I would just restart. <gasps> fuck, it does. The cheeky little assholes. Fuck them. I'm doing it again. All right, we're starting with Basil. Those ass. I knew they said it there for that reason. Uh-oh.
Oh. What the fuck was that? He's like, every time we see Basil, he has like this terrified look in his face, right? And that one time when he disappeared too, his eyes turned red, right? It seemed like the darkness was taking over. Oh, you bitch. You bitch. I'm going to do that again. Yeah, you think I won't? You think I'm going to just be like, nah, that's good enough. No, fuck you. No, fuck you. Do that shit again. Swing my toilet ramen again. I wonder if there's actually like, you know, it'd be really cheeky is if they stuck like a hidden tape to the side here. Oh my God, that one's so cheeky. That have been the cheekiest shit ever. All right. Amori. Now, we saw Basil freaked out, but Amori, like, never emotes. So, what will this look like? Just blank? Oh, him at the piano. Seemingly sunny, I think. No, this is Amori. We came across a piano that had Amori printed on it, right? And it was kind of hard to tell because... I think the difference between Sunny and Amori are like one of the stark differences, aside from the fact that, you know, of no color or whatever, but it's also their clothing, right? Amori has these dark socks on that uh, Sunny doesn't have. Why is Amori put on the, on the piano if his real name is Sunny, right? It's like a brand of piano? Was Sunny like a musical prodigy or something? Like, did he just learn to play the piano? And I mean, the fact that he also seemingly was learning to play the violin? I don't know, I'm just not sure how that ties into stuff. Uh, I'm Jeff from Many Towns, Master Many Trades. How can I help you today? Uh, oh shit, you give me, uh, emotion items. Okay. Neat. Oh shit, can I finally do stuff with the ghosts now? My goodness, what a pick timing. I seem to have myself in quite a predicament. You should have said Sticky Wicket. I've sent letters to a number of acquaintances asking him to attend the elegant feast of mine. But as of this moment, we not a single invite he has made in appearance. Not one. It's, it's preposterous. Unless there goes to be enraged, but my father says to me that they may simply become, have become lost on the way here. You see, when I sent out my invitations, I forgot to include directions to the venue. Being a true gentleman host, I refused to start this party until uh, all of my guests have arrived. To be so kind to help my, ge my guests find their way here. All right, here we go. Hey, here, sir. Here's some apps with directions to my party. Step with my own personal top hat seal of approval. Six spooky maps. Okay. Please deliver these masks to my guests. They will find their way here on their own journey. Ah, uh, finally I can do some of the, the ghosts. It's been uh, a ghost party. Uh-oh. <laughs> Is it supposed to be like, ooh? Finally I can do some of the ghosts. Come across quite a few of them. I, I, I do remember at least where, a, at least a number of them are. Oh yeah, some nutritious candy, which is like, yes. Oh, is this party have all the food that I've encountered at the picnic? I think it does. Some questionable gelatin. I think that's new. Yeah, it is. All the food I've come across. And a few extra ones that I probably will come across. <laughs> Woo! Wee! Party guy! Woo! 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 Oh. Oh. <laughs> that's amazing. I love it. It's my step alive! Woo! All right, cool. We will find your friends, Mr. Ghost. But first, I gotta find my friends so I can go. Can I actually leave to other places? Imagine the reason why they're not letting you go anywhere else is because a lot of the NPC dialogue also is uh, based off your dialogue, right? Or well, based off your party members. Like sometimes they'll like respond to something somebody said. So if they if they allow you to go anywhere, then they'd have to go and change all that. And they're like, fuck that. <laughs> Once they find your party members, they can get out of there. Here's this fog. Where'd it come from? I don't know. Fuck you. Oh, I actually can't turn the music on and off. Definitely keep it on. It's too quiet otherwise. Uh, yay. Oh, good. I can, I can buy some more rotten milk. Thank God. And a fish taco. And a whole bunch of other shit I don't need. I guess I'll buy some fucking melon juice, because why not? Didn't even thank me. I think it's the first time I've, I've ever bought anything from him. Except from life, except for life jam. Last resort. I wonder if I can play casino games near. Hey, it's those two uh, girls from before to the left. They put me on a quest. Uh oh. Wait. Oh god, you're bad! Who said you can leave your post? Get back to work. Uh oh. Gator guy. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna fuck you up, dude. Get the shit out of here. Eat this. Ugh. 
But yeah, I've realized now the attack again actually makes him attack three times now instead of two. Or two more times. If you ever enjoying yourselves last resort, please let us know if you need anything. Yeah, you serious? Not again. Don't worry about it. That won't be a problem. Yeah, right. Uh -huh. Ooh, you, you got it. Mm -hmm. <gasps> no! No, skulls! It's such a random, like, non sequitur of, like, we all got tricked into signing contracts and getting jobs here at this casino. God, how did I get myself into this stump? Just one thing after another this week. Can I play the Can I play the slots? Yes, I can! Because, of course, right? It's not an RPG unless you can play the slots. All right, I'm going to bet, bet, bet. Spin. He wasted some clams. Do it again. Give me some useless clams, please. All right. All right that's enough. I love watching my harder money go into the machine never come out. Just watching it all disappear. Me too, man. Fiesta. I'm sick of slots, but there's not much else to do around here. Just go back to the city. Oh god, you're evil. Bang your post again, and I'm in real trouble now. You're gonna die today, kid. No, you first, sir. God, the, the range on that attack. Seriously, I did 362, and the last one I did like 450 or something. Seriously. That's a very wide range I have there on my attack. Very large variance. Oh, nuts, I lost again. Just know this machine's rigged. Got my left foot on it. Oh, hey, there's an N. Welcome to Black Space. Okay, now this one is a non-related letter, but I will take it. All right. So how do we do this? Draw the uh, one arm at a time. Uh, yep. Wow, we're actually, we're drawing them like in the center. Like watching them dangling go and going limp. So I've got this beneath a trap door. I feel like I must have missed this somewhere. Yeah. So we're going in order all the way. It's just that one. Oh my gosh, this guy tried to fucking scam me still. You serious question? Uh, complete organic bottle of water? Good lord. These guys all just say the exact same thing and just scam you in a new way. Gotta take a break from the slots. My arms start to cramp up real bad. Can I actually play, uh... Games for lucky and unlucky people. I guess I can't. Oh my god, guys, look at the greatest character in the entire game. There he is. Browse, what do you have to say? Ah! I lost all my money. Ah! I love you too, Browse. It's good to see you, man. I was afraid something happened to you. Man, I feel sick. This place spinning here is just me. So we're here because I have to be a good seller, but I haven't even got my first paycheck. I'm homo. If I'm counting this right, then I'm a homo. Guy next to me is up to something fishy, but I can't put my finger on it. Sister and I own a small cafe on the highway east of here. You should check it out. Really? The food is delicious. On the highway east of here. So you do just have to, you just have to keep walking until eventually you get there, right? There actually is something hidden out there. I wonder if I had to talk to her first, though. Yeah, uh, are you serious? Not again, man. Okay, you said the same, same shit. Okay, so, uh, hey, don't aggro me from up there. Only some of these guys actually attack me. Paying down, it's all the same, whatever. It's a job, I guess. At least it would be if I ever got paid. <laughs> it's a living! Oh, well, okay, these guys are just not even worth my dumb demon time. This guy's actually charging me a little more than the other guy did. I think I booked the wrong bus. This is what this place looks like in the advertisement. Damn, this guy wants me fucking dead. This dude just chases me forever. Oh! I was like, wait, that's. That is not Space Boy Friend. That is Pink Beard? The other guy that we talked about? Destroy, she said, cut out like these folks are making it out to me. I want my clans back you here. He's a lot bigger. Oh my god. What are you doing? Ross, where's the dumps? <laughs> yeah, it's the bird who was like, I gotta inform Captain Pinkbeard of what happened. You win some, you lose some. At least it's what one would expect. Not me, though. I just lose all the time. You actually wonder if it's actually impossible to win this currently. Next time I decide to take a vacation somewhere random, Rami, check the rings first. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, Okay, you guys are getting a fucking annoying, all right? I want to get my too high of a level compared to my other party members. I'm in for those big wins today. Oh, yeah, think it positive. Uh, I always find myself in precarious situations. I wonder if this counts. Seriously, do they just, like, throw, like, designs in a fucking slot machine themselves to get, like, the 
designs for these NPCs. Just like, what the shit? Let's throw some random sh shapes together, some color. I'm gonna have my little cousin fuck around with MS Paint until he gives us some, some funny. Hot dog guy! Hot dog. Hot dogs! Get your hot dogs here! My hot dog all comes down to clams, come on! Sure. Why does he have a two on his chest? Hot dog! Hot dog, give me a hot dog! Hot dog, hot dog, give me a hot dog, hot dog, hot dog! <laughs> give me more hot dogs! One more! Can't get enough fucking hot dogs! Shit. Put three on me! <laughs> I know, dude, I spot like six. You wanna learn a fact about sharks or and or pickles? If you give me a combo meal, I'll tell you what I know. Okay, fine. Take my combo meal. Thanks a lot. Would you like to learn about sharks or pickles? Uh, pickles. Great, here's what I know. Think it's possible that you have scurvy? Then maybe you should have, should, should have eaten a pickle. What? I'm gonna eat you instead, how about that? All right, sharks. Great, here's what I know. Sharks can only swim forward. Isn't that inspiring? I think so. Thanks. A shelf full of various types of fruit juice. Hot dog, hot dog right here, boy. This guy's stuck by it. Oh, he is. Aha! Thanks, invisible wall. Travel all the way here for the city for this. I need a vacation for my vacation. Ah, oh, fuck. Amari, it's probably not a good time, but I really, really have to go to the bathroom. As I always say, we gotta go, you gotta go, I gotta go. I'm going. God damn it. Okay, fine. These guys all have bottled water. Oh, this one's the cheapest. Fuck you. Wow, paying for the VIP experience here was the best decision I ever made. Just came back from exclusive. All you can eat, all you can spend buffet. And I heard there was gonna be a tofu fundraiser tonight. You can count me in. Expensive books for show. Is this like the mob shark guy that owns this place? Fireplace. Fire is the fire is wet. You know what? So it's I'm seeing the pattern here, right? We've already gone through two like big bosses. Well, the first one was uh, focused on anger. The last one focused on happy. So I'm guessing this one will focus on sad, right? He'll buff himself up by getting sadder and sadder, which will increase his defense and shit. Just betting. This place is amazing. I haven't had the time of my life. This place again, which we have still not gotten the password for. Pool or billiards? One or the other. Let's go in the girls' bathroom. I can't. <gasps> Pete. Uh, welcome to Black. I need that one. Hold on, Mario. Just take a moment. Ah, oh God, oh, I feel so fucking good. Holy shit, you have no idea. We've been, I've been holding that in since we started this game. And that was like, what? Like fucking three weeks ago? You notice Kel didn't wash his hands. Gross, don't touch me. Hey, they're good looking. Yeah. What's cooking good looking? Oh, by the way, you guys should also point out, apparently I missed a, a neat little secret if I had, uh, you made Kel wash his hands, ha ha. Um, Oh, that's, oh, that's right. Didn't they say, uh, Basil was the one that told Kel to wash his hands? Except I did it this time, because Basil's not here. Um, but you guys told me that apparently back when you were controlling just Amori and everybody was gone, you could have looked in the mirror and, uh, would have gotten something. So I'll have to, I'll have to do that next time, assuming that happens in the other route. Uh, I see something was here. Ripley, Spacely, Saki. <laughs> not sure what that says. All right. Let's create a hole on the toilet. <laughs> Can I flush myself down the toilet? <gasps> create a hole over there. Three keys left. Oh boy, now what? Uh oh. Starting to get really weird looking. Uh oh. That doesn't look good. Oh no, don't eat me. Um, nom, 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 nom. God damn, there better not be another choice of things in here. Oh, that was it. You bastard. Okay, ah, leave me alone. Very expensive and controversial art piece. Is that what that is? Looks like just a regular aquarium. <gasps> Mario, what are you doing in the elevator? Well, this is awkward. Is this a cool elevator? So it's kind of like perfume and smoke. Oh, hi, Mari. Hello, you two. You two silly bitties. Let's see now. So if I got this straight, Aubrey's on the fifth floor. But this is working. This is like Luigi's Mansion. I gotta find the buttons and some shit. Oh, uh, yeah, I totally forgot. I need a cool key card for this. Damn it. They took my away because I kept losing it. I swear they're disappearing on their own, though. Let's try to look around the other floors for one. 
There's gotta be a cool key card around here somewhere. Hi, little brother. Are you feeling a little bit better now? Why don't you join a nice picnic with me here inside this cramped elevator? That was just to cheer you up. Have some of my freaking delicious sushi. Mmm, yummy. Mario, you're everywhere. How do you keep beating me? Okay. B1. Hey, what's up, man? I'm Burpo, and I wouldn't... I wouldn't be anyone but me. Burp... Bur Burpmo. Good for you, Burpmo. I don't want to be anybody but me, too. For some reason, I can't run in this area. What the hell? Why can't I run? Take it easy. We ain't gonna fight you. At least not while they're off the clock. <laughs> Break room. Music's going in for some reason. Oh, I see Hero over there. Is he the employee of the month? I got everyone pizza. Damn, he's really loud here for some reason. I swear. Next guy, godly leftover fish in the microwave is gonna hear from me. Cabinet. Found a fish taco. Taco, yes. Leave more stuff in there, please. Oh, there's a map. Bills, bills, bills. Yep. Hero's ploy of the month. Wow. Good for you, hero. Yeah, our stocks are falling. I mean, I mean rising at an alarming rate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Betting machine. I'm good. Got a punching bag. Uh, has a picture of Kel on it. Where starts angry in battle? Hey, there we go. So now I've got one of each. You got a one that makes you angry, one makes you sad, and uh, uh, one makes you happy. Yeah. Why is that picture on me? What? So many people don't like me? Oh, good. I found some rotten milk. Thank God. Uh, I found a poetry book. Locker, locker. And these open? I found, oh, I found fruit juice? We ain't liable if it's like, if anything goes wrong in these lockers. Leave valuables at home, people. Bottle water. Okay, that seems to be uh, everything in here. Oh, wait, wait, pizza. Mmm, pizza. Brain juice that is also not for kids. A smoke stick. Gotta love them smoke sticks. All right. Okay, floor two. Hey, it's uh, happy. Clean and clean and clean and clean. Boss told me to paint wherever, I, whatever I want, so I'm painting some flowers. Ah, I'm the rock paper scissors champion. If you beat me, rock paper scissors, I'll give you my entire life savings. Ready? What? Do I, I don't even know what I picked. What? A tie! Makes it all merch victorious. Oh, did I pick rock? You see, yeah, he's rock, right? He's always gonna be rock. Because he looks like a rock. Maybe? Huh? So this is defeat. You have humbled me, challenger. I promise you may take my entire life savings. Three clams. Somehow I knew it was gonna be not much. At least I'll spend all in one place. I should have lost. Just see what would happen. Uh, infomercial. Stop there! It's better way! Finally, a safe and effective solution. It just makes sense. Even comes with matching case. Garlic calls work. Pick up that phone now. I don't know. Suddenly, you want to buy a sham wow. I don't know why, Mori. Doll with an empty face. Doesn't look like it belongs here. Would you like to throw it away? Yes. The face of stall examines your features. Uh oh. Come on, pick up, pick up. I want that sham wow. Come on, man. The fuck was that? It's just the same thing every time. Seems that way. Ah, <gasps> he's back out. Throw it away. Damn it, get in the fucking trash can. Stay there. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. <laughs> I was like, I don't think this is doing it. No, it actually did. Oh my God, that looks like me. It's all the familiar face. Does he have a knife in his back? Uh-oh. Freaky. Can't do anything with it either. Oh, God. It's like he might attack me or something. Hey, it's this dude. Boss tried to put me to use, but when he realized I couldn't do anything, he told me to be a bed tester. 
Mm. Yup. This bed sure feels good. A sticky phone. Ew! <gasps> Big rubber band! I got a cool key card. Cool, we found a cool key card. We should be able to get a fifth floor from the elevator now. Let's go find our break. I don't know if I should go anywhere, everywhere else first, or... It's all natural, so we apply to before and after photos of uh, Grandma Abs and blah, blah, blah. It's like, I like it's just like a random assortment of infomercial jargon. Uh, yes, yeah, let's go get Aubrey. Use cool key card. Sir Johnson, 1920 to 1950. Lord Johnson. Oh my God. Professor Jawsome, Dr. Jawsome, Mr. Jawsome. Yep, he's the only one they bothered to sprite. He came from a long line of different sharks. And this one decided to put on a suit and sunglasses. Whoa, 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 look we have here. You trying to talk to the big boss, are you? Sorry, Mr. Bubba, I can't just let anyone through here willy-nilly. Oh man, really? Come on, barely, we know you forever. You can't do it, you can't do us a small little favor. Sorry, Kellis, the boss orders. There's a big day, so he doesn't want any disturbances. We got a total fundraiser to prepare for tonight. But barely, it's me, all right? It's your boy, Kel. Your old friend, Kel. Me and you go way back. Think of all the good times together and all the stupid sub quests we had to do, to you, do for you. Hey, quit it. Maybe, maybe I'm scared of a reason. You want someone tough. Someone to make, can make the hard decisions. Hard-headed person. I mean, look at my badge. They're shiny. Hmm. Quick, Cal. Think of something fast. Oh, I know. Hey, Burly. Our good friend Amari here is interested in a job. You know the boss would never turn down free work. Hmm. That is true, but... Please, Burly! Please, 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 please! Oh, all right. I'll let you through this time. But only if you give me some bottled water first. I'm parched. Oh, I got plenty of that. I'm not gonna lie, you gotta kiss Burly first. Burly. One move unless Burly moves. Hey, got me some bottled water. Thanks, oh you want. Come on, boys. Here they, they got pizza in the break room. Yeah, all right, free pizza. Yeah. Yeah, I hope there aren't any pineapples on it. What kind of sick, twisted fuck would do that to a perfectly good pizza? I like pineapples on my pizza. Fuck you. Stabs the sharing. Ah! Ow, what the fuck? Ow. Fuck you. This is not a letter I need, but fuck it, invest. All right, we got to have two arms now, I think, right? Yep. Now we just need uh, two legs, and I don't know, unless they plan to draw a happy face or a sad face on it. Concierge, invest. Ah! Investment shark tells the turn ass. Jerko, what's with the big boss man telling everyone to wait? Who does he think he is? So I'm obliged to know. I'm Jerko. Scuba. Oh, I'm late for my payments again. My Mr. Johnson's going to have my head on a stick. Woe is me. Woe is me. What the hell is this buff chicken? Oh, I hear Johnson had a new bodyguard who was real tough, but there's no way he's going to be matched for a touchdown. Boss called me in for the poor meeting, but he's not available right now. I don't know. Shall we here? I keep working. Well, it's a dead body over there, so I, I, I think he probably waited for a while, too. It is not alive. Hey, look, it's another Mr. Saturn. I'm waiting here in order to conduct some important business, and then afterwards, I will conduct more important business. Nah, nah, nah. Jossam awesome and I, we have many matters to discuss. Yes, many, many things, yes. Oh jeez, oh jeez, Rick. It's just gotta be me who has to tell Johnson that another investor's back you out. Oh jeez, yeah, shut up, shut up, Morty. No, 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 no time for this, okay? Ah, oh, Morty, you're so fucking useless. Oh jeez, Rick, why are you gonna shit all over me, Rick? Some of all right, but there's no way I'm gonna tell him that. Talk to me. Hello? Please hold. Hello? Please hold. Hello? Please hold. Hello? Help! Aubrey! We're breaking out. Dang, he'll go away. Can you see him fucking busy? Look how many fucking boats are in here! Step out of it, uh, Aubrey. This isn't who you are, all right? You're not a corporate cog. You know, three people canceled their meetings today. Three people! Ah! I would fucking bash their brains with this bat if I could find them. 
I'm supposed to reschedule them, but I don't even know how that's going to fit with all these useless events planned. Not to mention, we have a fundraiser tonight. And of all things, it's a tofu fundraiser. I hate tofu! Who in the right mind will pay class for tofu? I tricked on the boss so many times, but he won't listen. It's a complete nightmare! Okay, Aubrey, I'm gonna need you to breathe, all right? Breathe, breathe in, breathe out. Shut the fuck up, Cal! I'm breathing! Breathing is fine! Deep breaths, Aubrey. Deep breaths. Mm. Ah. He. Oh. He. You are not a secretary. He. Ah. Basil's missing. We need to find him. Good. Breathe out. Breathe out harder. Okay, good. Good. Maybe uh, maybe a little less hard. Oh my god, that's right. Fuck! How can I forget? We need to find a basil. Oh more, is that you? I thought you were dead. Must be here to save me. I'm so happy. Whatever. Wait, what about me? I was the one who taught you the deep breath thing. God damn it. You think this baby's gonna deliver itself, Aubrey? What baby? I don't know. I don't know what we're talking about anymore. More, you have to get me out of here. We can just leave, Aubrey. The exit's right there. You stupid idiot. It's not that simple, Kel. We signed contracts, remember? I know. I was there. I remember that day. Many years ago. Uh, Aubrey? Aubrey? Where have you been? We're trying to get a hold of you for the past 10 seconds. How's that rescheduling going? It's gotta be like the boss, right? So sorry, Mr. Johnson. The sun came up. Hi, Mr. Johnson! It's me, Cal! Dang it, you again, Cal. Thought we sent you far, far away from here. Did not tell you not to leave your post. Well, I can only back firstly tell you that I quit. And bring Aubrey with me. Very funny. My office, Cal. Now. I'll send him in right away. You too, Aubrey. Psst. Dang, Cal, you're gonna get me fired! I know, isn't it great? <sighs> Come on, let's go. Let's dress in the office, wrap this elevator. All right, that's one character found. The phones keep ringing. <laughs> Telephone calls up the wazoo <laughs> for the extra hard nights. Damn it, Aubrey, have you been drinking again? Shut up, okay? So is he let me put up with people's bullshit, okay? Do you know how many phone calls I get from old ladies who don't know how to work the phone? Damn! Oh, whatever, I am in need of sta fast stacks of cash. Whatever, whatever. Mr. Jossum, that's the name that you'll get it. And I'll get everyone's attention around here. I hear he's the type that won't ever let his, ever get his hands dirty. And I don't blame for it. I do the same if I could find, get anything I wanted with a snap of my fingers. Assuming I actually had fingers. Expensive books. Stocks are up still. Um, pay bills and legal fees. All right. A shuffle of various types of fruit juice. I got fruit juice? What the fuck is this shit, huh? Uh, you're not sure what fruit it is. Heal 75 juice. Mmm. It's fucking tr It's gonna be- It's just gonna be drunk. Sure, there's a lot of elevators here. fuck is happening? Stop that! I was whistling. Oh, we're back. Man, that is a... That is one fucking shrewd-looking business shark. Loan shark. Finally here. Hi, Mr. Jossum. Ahem. All right, kids, let me lay this down for you. As the contract states here, you have agreed to work for me for better or for worse without pay for the rest of your life. 
How the hell did he convince you guys to sign that? I don't know. I was drunk. Now, a contract is a promise, and you wouldn't break a promise, would you? Shoot, he's right. We can't break a promise. That's a no-no. What do we do, Aubrey? We break the promise. Mr. Jocelyn, it's true that we did make a promise to you. But we also promised each other that we found our friend Basil together. Uh, yeah, that's right. That means you have to let us go. Hmm, I guess I can respect that. A promise is a promise. Aubrey, I'll let you leave. But you have to take care with you. Really? Well, thank you, Mr. Jocelyn. You're too kind. Awesome, let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Wait. I think I'm forgetting something. Oh, yeah. Can we bring my brother here with us, too? Oh, no, I can't. Because he's employee of the month. He's his best worker, right? <laughs> you really are funny, kid, kill. <laughs> you want me to give you hero? That's rich. Rich, I tell you. Hero is fins down. The best worker I've ever hired in my life. It's very precious. He increased my work output by 700%. I'd be a fool to let go of a worker like him. To him? Yep. Mr. Jawsome, I just finished setting up the tofu fundraiser like you asked. The tables are set, the room is decorated, the toilets are clean, the food tastes spectacular, if I do say so myself. I also cleaned your windows, mopped your floors, fed your pets, organized your sunglass collection, folded your laundry. Oh, and here's your coffee. Just thought you'd enjoy that. I love how this little fin on top of the drink. It's adorable. Yaha, you know just the way I like it. Ja ha ha. You see, kids? Amazing work, hero. Just amazing. I might even consider paying you one of these days. Ja ha ha. Really? That'd be an honor, sir. Oh, well, hey guys, what are you doing here? Are you looking for a job too, Amori? Hero, what happened to you? Don't tell me that even you forgot about Basil. Oh, shoot, that's right. We need to find Basil. Oh, Jiminy Cricket. How can I forget something so important? What are we doing here? Why, we gotta go right away. Whoa there, Hero, not so fast. You still got some unfinished work to do. You're supposed to usher in all our VIPs for the fundraiser tonight. Damn, it. This theme is great, holy shit. Mr. Jossum, I'm sorry, but with all due respect, the token fundraiser can wait. Huh. My feelings are hurt, hero. You haven't forgotten about our contract, have you? Well, I... Could forget the contract. Business means a switch go, hero. Ja -ha -ha. Don't listen to her, hero. Why would you? You didn't even sign a contract with her. I will listen to Aubrey because of a contract. I'll serve because she's my friend. I'm sorry, Mr. Jossum. Your friends are more important than a measly piece of paper. Measly piece of paper? You disrespect me, boy. I take you in, a youngin' with no experience, and I turn you into the ultimate employee. You would be nothing if it wasn't for me. Uh-oh. Here come the alligators. Hey, what's up, sir? The punishment for breaking a contract is death. I'll teach you respect to your superiors. Uh-oh. Boys, would you be so kind as to show these kids the way out? I don't think so. Mr. Jossum, you about to demon die today. All right, here we go. Lowers attack, pep up Cal. Annoy him. Let's do the award winning move here. Look at you! Oh, I actually hit the other two as well. Interesting. Uh, oh, everybody feels fucking pissed. Good. I want you to feel pissed. All right. Reduce all of his stats. Break his defense some more. Flex it. And, uh, fucking punch this dude. Ah, uh, yeah! Look at me. <laughs> Mr. Jaw feels so comfortable. Tech Agoni Lord. Uh. 
Ah, hit the other guys too. Yeah. This is supposed to be like a hit all attack. Or maybe, are they guarding for him? Oh, maybe that's what they're doing. Maybe they're just standing in the way. That actually might be it. Everyone feels very angry right now. Actually, yeah, that is what's happening. They're, they're stopping him from taking any damage. So actually, until I kill these guys, I shouldn't uh, even try to hurt him. Attack again. Yep, there we go. Want these kids gone, you understand? Get a guy who runs them, gets, get out, out, gets free pizza on me. Mr. Austin, what, what do you mean by let low on henchmen? That's impossible. Uh, picks this phone calls the gator guy. Gator guy is rough. Oh shit, ow, ow, ow. Damn it. Stop showing up, you dickheads. I want to run and gun fucking Mr. Jossum. I made myself even happier. Oh shit, I put it in the wrong person. Shit. Just picks up the calls the gator guy. Oh shit. Damn it. I'm calling the gator guys. What the hell? I suddenly jump Mr. Jossum has no health. I didn't even hit him though. So that's gotta be a glitch. Oh wait, unless I gotta kill these guys and then she hits him. Oh, that is it, isn't it? Oh. You let yourself be foiled by a bunch of children. What I even hire you for? Yeah. Okay, that was it. Actually, wasn't. I was just. He was that close to death. He says he doesn't actually have that much health. You found contract. I didn't get to use my move though. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> Buy high, sell low. That was the name of this achievement. That's enough. Stand down, man. We're getting nowhere like this. Those guys were dead. Huh. I gotta admit, you kids are pretty strong. But that doesn't matter now. Here wasn't the only ultimate employee in my workforce. I have, but one other. Burly? You come in now, Pluto. What? <gasps> no, not Pluto! Pluto, it's me, Cal, your best friend! Don't you recognize this? We're your friends. You taught me to flex. You taught me the bust, bust, and move. Sorry, Kale. This is nothing personal. It's just business. Uh-oh. <laughs> Let's see how you do against the strength of a former planet. We've already fought him before, though. Come on. Pluto, show these kids your true power. Right away, sir. Uh-oh. I'm sorry, everyone. This is the end of the road for you. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my god, he's destroying the fabric of reality! What awesome demon power is this? Oh my god, did he just kill him too? Uh-oh. I don't feel good about this. Oh my god, Swole Pluto! Oh my god, the music's going in. His theme... Did his theme just get even better? Is it possible? Behold! This is my final form. Can you feel the heat? Oh my god! Music's going the fuck in, let's go! Get a little thing it healed me. All right, let's try this again. Once more, with Pluto expanded! Oh, look at those fucking muscles! Gotta take that attack down! Uh. Ow. Oh my god, this fucking power! Sweet, awesome power! 
Never felt anything like it. Ah, I'm gonna show you the power of my flex Pluto. I'll show you my power. The power that you bestowed onto me. And my chicken ball. Bring that shit down. Throws the moon, Aubrey, out. Impressive progress, young girl. Your flex has improved greatly. Oh, fuck, yes, he remarked on it. Oh, you don't know it. You don't know the half of it, motherfucker. I'm gonna show you what a real flex can do. Get ready. It's time. Time to die, asshole. Ah, I see. You have all gotten stronger, but so have I. Uh-oh. <gasps> Spade further, everything went up. Oh, shit. Oh, wait, he's dead already. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Kel looks at Blue and he's like, Bitch, you're already dead. <laughs> He's like, no. He's over here flexing. My power can go further, further. Dude, you're, you're dead. Just give it up. No, I'm not. I, what? 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 Fucking impossible. <laughs> well done, children. You've come a long way, but I am not finished yet. Uh-oh. Oh, come on, dude. Yes, you are. We didn't learn any new abilities. Oh, this power. <laughs> You've all gone, gone really strong, really gone strong. I'm so proud of you. But even still, I have a job to do. And I plan on finishing it. Brace yourselves, children. This is the definition of power. This is going further beyond when I flex. Uh-oh. No! God damn it, Pluto! I feel my best! All right, all right, break it up, break it up. That's only 10% of my power. <sighs> cool, Pluto. I'm not losing one ultimate employee today. Don't want to lose two. But, sir, I can defeat them. Just give me a little more time. Don't swear to Pluto. I ain't risking any more assets today. Poor Pluto. I just walks through it. I got achievement. When I flex, I feel my best. Just get out of here. You all been nothing but a pain in my tail anyway. Thank you, sir. It was actually like the last boss this area. Like, I'm kind of surprised to feel like we just like jumped straight to the end already. It wasn't really like, I mean, other than the gator dudes I ran through, which were the enemies only in that one area, except maybe the other floors that I didn't look at too. And yeah, this is really like the end of this section. It was really short. I kind of think not because, this, again, we didn't run to a dude that had, like, quote-unquote, afflicted sad on themselves, right? We've gotten happy and angry, right? It's going to happen. You won't regret this. Huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's really nothing I can do to get you to stay, huh? It's a pity. Gonna reach your true potential here. Mr. Johnson, before I go, I want to say that. Even after kidnapping all my friends, it's against and signing an ambiguous contract. I still sometimes thought of you as a pretty decent guy. Hero, this might come as a surprise to you, but fuck you! You don't know dick about me, boy! I always thought of you as a, the son I never had. I know you'll do some great things out there, you piece of shit. Now get lost already! Can't you see I'm busy? Thanks again, Mr. Jossum. Turns out he wasn't such a bad guy after all. Alright, everyone. Now we're all together and we continue our search for Basil. It's been a long journey, but I just know that we'll find him. As long as we don't give up. You're right, Hero. We're almost at the finish line. I can feel it. My first phase will be fun. You in no time at all. Ha 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 ha. Now that's the dedication I like to see. Go get him, you crazy kids. You kooky kids, you. Huh. Interesting. Maybe that is like the end of this section. Wow. <laughs> if so, that's a... No, short. No, I'm not gonna walk, run in here. Pluto, you okay, buddy? 
Hello there, children. I, I mean, I mean, ah, uh, surprise, children. Have you come to do battle with me again? Ha ha! I understand you well. I'm still feeling the aspects of our heated battle. It was a memory I shall cherish forever. You all grow incredibly strong, best with everything. There's still room to improve. Flex for me, Kill. Show me what I taught you. Yes, sir, Pluto, sir. Kel's ready for action now. Now, who am I punching? No, I'm afraid you are mistaken. In this challenge, I won't be testing your power. I'll be testing your endurance. Brace yourself, Kel. I won't be holding back. What's happening? <gasps> Kel gave 50 HP. Oh, thank fuck. He needed it the most. And lost the tooth. Oh fuck! Jesus Christ! Just get punched! Just get decked! Raha! Take that bitch! And he just pieces out. God, Pluto's the best. What a Chad! Uh, I'm fine. <laughs> oh my God! He has one health now. Ow! Wow! Even with that 50 health boost, he's still nowhere near Operator Hero. Though he actually just surpassed me. Now I have the lowest health. Okay, seriously, I need some booze after that shit. Ow! Elvira will not open. Who's this picture of right here? I didn't even get to see. Oh, wait. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, my God. I actually could see it. I had to look from the other side. Oh, that's cute. You're my son, hero. I love you. Cute. That's the picture he keeps on his desk. Oh, he's a softie after all. All right, before I forget, Mori, take this. Mr. Johnson gave it to me so I could get around last resort faster. Give you a VIP key card. Wow. There, now all the elevators should run faster. Just a warning though, size gets bumpy. Okay. Wow, that is fast. Hey, new person. Hi, I'm Mira. I'm new here. Uh, aren't you gonna answer the phones? Hi, I'm Mira. I'm new here. Okay. Looks like she's about as good as you were at this job, Aubrey. Hey! All right, well, I guess I'll go check the other floors that I uh, didn't examine. Okay, floor four. What the hell's going on over here? Oh, under construction? So I bumped into my mom on the way up here, and she won't stop nagging me. Wearing shades inside his path for your size, she says. You can't take off these shades just like that. They're like a part of me. Man, mom's visiting again. She must be empty nesting hard. What? Mom's here? I gotta go, go say hi later. Wait, is this thing they're all related to each other? Nah, Mom. <laughs> I think it looks that way. Yay, Mom's here. Yay. Oh, hey, there's the ghost right there. Do mind me. I am lost floating mustache killing about this day. Give a spooky map to mustache ghost. Hold on a second, what do we have here? Two extras to a top hat's party? Well, gee, I better skedaddle. Party doesn't start until I arrive. Yuck, 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 yuck. Get the fuck out of here, dude. There's a hole in the wall. Oh my god. What the fuck is going on over here? Oh, just outside the building. Also under, under construction. <gasps> Looks like a job for Aubrey. That's right. Now Aubrey's so I can smash things again. But only barrels. So you're all finally decided to move on, huh? Don't forget about us when you make a pick. Don't forget about the gator guys that uh, tried to kill you earlier. Oh my god, I see a statue of hero over there. <gasps> Demotion used to have me work in the security department. They said I was too soft. Her day made Burley head of security. They said she's got stiff upper lip. Yeah, you're just you're just too soft, man. Too soft and fluffy. Combo meal. Smoke stick. Humans are always trying for bigger and better things. Don't you run back crying when it gets tough. Uh, oh, okay. I guess that was, didn't really actually help at all. A coat rack, all the way up here. Have a seat, journey fellas, isn't it? Yeah, I guess growing up so fast, man. Cardboard. Lemonade. Then you sure you want to stay a bit longer here, Well, yeah, it wasn't worth a shot. For the extra hard nights. Is there a top to this shit? What the hell? Crusher by who said to do any work but management bad. Predicting fall of empire. Whole pizza. Where the fuck am I going? <gasps> hey. 
Oh, we're on the other side of this thing. Yes. All right, what letter we got? Uh, welcome to white space. Nope. But I'll take it anyway. All right, one leg. All right, I think I just need one more leg. That's it. Can I open like a shortcut or anything? No, really? That seems like I missed an opportunity to quickly get back here again. Fine, be that way. I'll just walk all the way the fuck back down. Oh, I didn't even see the ladder was right here, up here. Now press the statue of Hero. Wow, wow. Hey, just fish over here a statue of Emperor Boss orders. Look pretty good, I might add. Hello, brother. We're seeing each other a lot lately, huh? Come, anyways, come sit. It's not like you, you turned out a picnic. Hey, look here, you gotta admit. Food is pretty nice. But weirdly enough, we don't actually have a, a picnic here. Oh, maybe it was only if I was like with Kel or something. I bet it was. If, if I was just with Kel, we probably would have had a uh, picnic here. Or had like, or actually said something. A very, very long hero sandwich. Yep. This I also saw at the ghost party. This is basically all the food that's here. Various sculpting supplies. Blueprints for a 200 story skyscraper. Engineer, it's like a puzzle and I love puzzles. We know, dude, we know. <gasps> ball pit. Playing the ball pit with my friends. <laughs> we just sit there with this bored look on our face. Make it suck. Who doesn't like a good ball pit? And fuck these kids. The kids don't know fun. They bit them in the ass. Woohoo. Even in here, there's a glass of wine. We're only gonna watch the damn kids. Ah, uh, Pedro's in this place. You're not to make a mess. I mean, good job. Sure is tough. Hope Nose is doing okay without me. Nose is fine. He's he's looking after the front desk. Or she. Oh, my sweet sons are so hard at work. Oh my God, Bar Barbara Koa. Oh my God. But I'm not gonna cause them any trouble. Well, I might have killed a few of them. Or else. I'll smack you all the way to tomorrow. Oh my God. She can be bothered I killed a few of them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Ah! Oh yeah. Yeah. Ah! Hey kids, oh yeah, life gym guy. I saw life gym. Really work. We love about some day, oh yeah. Yes. Life gym, really work. Do it. God damn it. At least he didn't kill me this time. Clam coin. Oh, hey, my knife is dull now. Worn and harder to use. You can no longer see reflection. Oh, wow. Is it better or worse than it was? I would think worse. How's my attack compare? Well, it's still up there. I don't know, because I can't take it off. To see how much how much damage it actually does. Oh, hey, contract is actually a, a uh, an accessory. Trades heart and juice for other stats. <gasps> Holy shit! Wow, it really boosts your stats, but it, it basically makes you into a glass cannon. Definitely not worth it. Clam coins said to bring great wealth and fortune. Increases clams earned in battle. Ow! Help room service. There's a life jam man in my bed. Hello, who's this? Sorry, you have the wrong number. Hello, who's this? This is Patrick. Hello, is this Amari? No, this is Patrick. I'm not in the Amari. Oh, yeah. Wolf, I say I don't mind this place at all. It's not bad at all for being free, even if the kitty pool outside is haunted. So I came here on a look. Oh, no, oh, no, honeymoon because they offered a free room and a luxury resort experience. Luxury room I bought. This place has shoddy as it gets. You can already see the paint coming off the walls. A fedora? Uh, Mr. Johnson pulls it off. Defense plus five, luck plus five. Neat. <laughs> nose goes! Bzz. Thanks, Nose. Basement floor, because I'm betting Burley is in here now, right? Yep. Oh, all kinds of beats up now. You know, I've been feeling a little inventive lately. I got the need to pick something big, something amazing. Oh, boy. I'll make the biggest, baddest, most awful weapon there is. No promise that I'm lacking inspiration. I'm looking for a spur material to make the ultimate weapon. Sweet. Is that for me or somebody else? It's like pliable yet sturdy. Perhaps a bit buoyant. I can find something like that for me. I'll definitely make the ultimate weapon for you. Pliable yet sturdy and perhaps a bit buoyant. A lifesaver. Ah, pineapples. Ah. All right. Get me the fuck out of here. This guy still attack me? I'm guessing not. Nope. Not anymore. I go to the ladies' bathroom now. Oh, I just Aubrey went in. That's cute. Vanny, but the mirror makes you look especially flattering. A pink mirror. I am the mirror on the wall. I dubbed thee the cutest one of them all. Yay! <laughs> you are beautiful. 
Still got toilet ramen. Flowers. Does anyone want to go in the boys' wrath restroom? It's just... Yep. What's cooking good looking? <laughs> That'd be a dick move. They stuck a fucking... Fucking letter in the girls' bathroom. And we can never pick it up. They're my friends again. Your friends smile warmly behind you. What? Jesse? Bro told me to wait here, but I don't know if he's coming back in time soon. You know what name Mr. Johnson? Bro says he's got some business with him. Jesse! Alright. Now what? Well, the gang is back. High five, everyone. Hey, it's high five everybody else. So, does anyone remember how we ended up here? You know, I had the strangest dream. There were all of us falling down an endless black hole. And next thing you know, I'm signing my life away through a contract. You know what they say? It sure is strange where life takes you. So what are we doing again? We were looking for Basil or something, right? Yes, that's right, Kel. We're looking for Basil, whoever that is. Hmm. Do you think Basil gets to be somewhere in the last resort? No way. Basil wouldn't be caught dead here. We just also ran everywhere here. Come on. Do you see like that person would enjoy things like this? I don't know. Does he? Why don't you just go around and ask if they... Why don't you just go around and ask if they've seen him? Good thinking, Kel. Though I guess we are pretty far away from home. I think anyone here would know what he looks like. Oh, I have an idea. Why don't we all draw a picture of it? Maybe we'll be able to recognize him from the drawing. You are full of good ideas today. Sounds like a plan. Why did we wait so long to do this? Cool, I'll start. Um, what is that? Looks kind of like Basil. His hair more like this. Are they like forgot what he looks like? Hmm, no way. That doesn't look right either. Hey, what are you doing to my masterpiece? And when did Basil have such a big nose? Bro, see what we're doing. Eesh. Is that really what Basil looks like? Oh, I can't look. Here, put the bad drawing in your pocket. Huh? Well, that didn't go so well. Don't be so down, Aubrey. We just look for Basil ourselves. Yeah, I'll be okay. There's plenty of places we haven't looked yet. Hmm. Why don't we start searching around the deep well? Get there pretty easily by taxi. There's always one in front of last resort. It's like they, they keep forgetting, right? They're, they, they, like, they're starting to forget about Basil entirely. Why is that? That's why they've forgotten this. They're like, what are we doing? Oh, we're looking for Basil, right. Are they like moving on without him or something? Did they like... Is this thing that happened in real life where they just kind of like abandoned him? Leave him alone to the darkness. I also have to find all of the, uh... Hey! 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 Gotta find all the ghosts. Or have you been working out? Looking good, Amari! <laughs> That's funny. What a hunk! Oh my god. Is this thing different every time? Oh, Abby, you're so dreamy. Do you like anything, sir? A fruit juice? A back massage, some croutons. Wow, I could get used to this. <laughs> My turn. It is I, Kel of the future. I'm gonna have so much muscle I can barely be able to walk. Strike a pose. Hoo -ah! Hoo -ah! I'm gonna get all the girls, just you wait. Not like that, you won't. Hey, fuck you, bitch. You don't know shit. Hot fuck. Yeah, yeah. Sell down, ladies. There's enough for me to go around. Also tell Mari. Sorry. No, don't tell me, please. No. <laughs> that was cute. Oh, hey, I can break the shit. Give me item. Give me bottled water. A beach ball. That's got to be for me. Too bad I got a chicken ball, so nothing. everything else is garbage in comparison. This is literally half the speed. Ten more attack. Fuck you. Chicken Ball Z will always be the best. All right. So they mentioned that there was a mermaid thing, right? To the to the east. There's the moo cow again. So I'm just going to keep running to the right until something happens. Waiting for something to... Okay. I've been around for a while. I'm not getting anything. I don't think this is right. Damn it. Okay. Well, in that case... Go back to last resort. Unless there's like another taxi here that I just didn't see. That also takes me somewhere else. Over here? No? Right? That I'm pretty sure they said to the east. Oh, and a small cafe on the highway east of here. You should check it out. The food is delicious. 
Is, I wonder if it's just totally fucking random, whether you like come across it or not. Ah, oh, whatever. Back to deep well. Oh, hey. Really have three friends. Yeah, all right, all right, let's get a move on, people. Oh my God, I was a snake the whole time. Uh. Hey, yes, I need that. Underwater highway. Holy shit. And another, uh, Pluto stop. <gasps> oh, God, sir. Hey, isn't that sweetheart? Hey, sweetheart, remember us? Were the kids that almost turned your wedding and almost killed you and shit? What are you for again? Why do you, sh why do you keep showing up? So, how's married life treating you? Ha, huh, married life is a joke. I didn't release with that pitiful excuse of a captain a long time ago. Of course you did, because they're garbage. But your wedding was literally yesterday. Oh no, does that mean you and Space Husband are? Huh, he's Space Ex Husband now for all I care. Ow, that poor guy. Alas, my journey has gone full circle. It's more obvious to me now than ever that my perfect suit does not exist. Don't say that, sweetheart. I'm sure your soulmate's out there somewhere. No, they aren't. You're terrible. No one will ever want to be with you. You deserve to die alone. Oh, my sweet hero, I will live long for your voice. Oh, God damn it. But no, I must refrain. I've already decided my path. Searching for a suitor is much too old-fashioned for me. So I've decided that I will simply just make one. What? Make a suitor? Is that impossible? By regular people of means, no. But a wealthy person such as myself does not abide by such rules. I'm going someplace only filthy rich people like myself can afford. To a family of sea which is specialized in clients with special demands. What? To Lupus and Sabine for my appointment. Oh my god. So, should we follow her or what? It's like every time Swear shows up, something bad happens. Yeah, when it comes to disaster, she's in a league of her own. I don't want to follow her. I want to go someplace. I gotta get that letter too. I got some buff clams over here. <gasps> oh my god, fish bunny! Fish bunny! Why are you so sad, fish bunny? Is, are you sad because you're a bunny and a fish feast together? Some terrible monstrosity? We're gonna put you out of your misery, fish bunny. Be happy. Be happy. Fish bunny died that day. Ah, did it. A shelf full of various types of fruit juice. Small furniture and miscellaneous knickknacks. the hell that sound is exactly uh whoa so stolen furniture inner tube makes swimming easier yet harder Def defense increases with more energy oh okay cool more toilet ramen that's an enemy oh my god oh it's muscles i get it ha 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 Start of your muscles, my beautiful muscles. You have a decent amount of experience. Watermelon juice. Juicy juice. Oh, I see a chest over on the other side I missed. What in the hell is that? Oh God, fish head. Reverse mermaid. Ha ah, ha ha. I get it. It's reminds me of a, of a family guy a bit. I wish to make love to you. 707. Uh, Albuquerque. You here because you didn't want to play the, pay the toll? You know, third group I've seen this way. Going all the way, this way is kind of inconvenient, but at least you get to uh, hold on to those sweet, sweet clams. You'll want to pay the last toll, though. Trust me. Is that what I'm doing? Did you even talk to the toll booth guy? Maybe. Maybe I should have. What is that thing? Shark fin? It is a shark fin with a face on it. Oh, it's a bit of amazing here. Warrior grew level two, 32. All right. Kind of my, oh my God, go all the crap. Don't look at me. I'm hideous. Don't look at me. What in the hell? Got a gold watch. 
Uh, oh, is this actually a gold watch? So, useless in battle, and then an actual gold watch? Oh, wait. Oh, yep. Definitely 100% gold. You can tell by the weight. Minus 10 speed. What? So it does nothing? Still useless in fight. Are we level 32? Yes. All right. Still no new skills, though. Uh-oh. Oh, I guess we found her. <laughs> oh! Okay, clearly I'm going the right way. Which isn't actually what I wanted to do. I just thought I was going off a side path. I want to go the wrong way. Keep filling in the holes so they just keep coming back. He piles every day. I'm just getting tired. You paid overtime for this. So you can start to the gate. Get off here. It's private property. Okay, yeah, it'll be my pleasure. It'll cost you 2,000 bucks. Seriously, any of these papers, love holes, you have 2,000 clams just like that. There you go, 2,000 clams. That easy. Hey, by the way, be careful about the interest. We're we'll be collecting. Here comes collecting time. Oh, shit. Uh oh. I did not mean to say that. Fine, just take it. Does it just stay that way now forever? Oh, it does. Whatever, I'm rich as fuck. I don't give a shit. <laughs> Oh, where, where am I? Ah, crap. Boss, look, I was asleep. I was just... Oh, here's so much kids. Yeah, I bet you want me to open the gate. I'm going to be real with you. The whole price is jacked. It's going to cost you 3000 I'd find another way around if I were you. Yeah. Really? Just got that kind of money lying around? I'm just swimming on it. All right, gate's open. Yeah, fuck you. Give me that fucking ass. I got so much money, I don't even have anything to spend on, so it's, it's all that matters. Two keys left! Look into the hole. Uh-oh. That doesn't look good. Please avoid my spikes at all costs. Thank you. A cool bike. Respect your community, city slicker. I don't need charity. Be kind to others. Oh my god! Love yourself! Damn, these are the nicest biker gang people I've ever met. All natural sea cow farms. Oh, here's a bit warmer than it is the cave. Than it is in the cave up in the mountains. <sighs> sea cows. What the hell? What the fuck is that? Squizzard. Creepy. Die. You're not sea cows at all. I don't think. Oh my god. Uh, moo? So it's just going in circles. What the hell? Can't do anything to him. Uh, moo? I bought a fresh chunky sea cow milk. Man, that sounds good. Or drink that. I mean, chew that. Hey, the part now around this place I've known as sea cow farm, farm, but you can just call him a gym. Uh, gym. Sorry. This farm has been a family business that's going on for generations. The upkeep ain't so easy with the land being around my squizzes and all. Tell you what, with all those damn squizzes running around, it's miracle so I'm still standing. If only there was someone who could help me get rid of these damn squizzes, I'd pay anything. Hey, you know what? I just have a brilliant idea. If y'all might get rid of those slimy, sticky squizzes, I'd have employer services for some clams. No ain't much, that's all I got. Uh, okay, sure. I will kill the squizzards. I guess I have to kill all these other ones to deal with the one in the corner there. Level 33 for everybody else. I actually wonder if maybe we've learned our, all our skills by this point or something. I haven't, learned, I haven't learned a new skill in like three levels. Since I got to level 30. I just realized the reverse fish guy, his, his health bar is backwards too. That's funny. All right, so it's you. Uh, so I can't do anything to him. Oh, I guess I counted. Hey, y'all know that there are less squizzes called thrown around these parts. You kids are doing the fair share work. It's a classy effort. Let's go and get some knife for yourself. Yuck. Neat. Uh, oh, okay. Do they just like respawn? Uh, yes, they do. Oh, God. How many do I have to fucking kill for this quest to end? Oh, 
Oh, this is the place they were talking about. This is the west, ma'am, not the east. Oh, I see space boyfriend over there, ex-husband. I'm Sadie. My sister and I started this cafe together. Since Claire's been tied a lot, my sister started working at last resort. Just me and my sister Eleanor left. Ah, <sighs> wish they would come back here. Do anything to hear them sing again. Mustard sub, may I take your order? Got cheeseburger, fries, tasty soda, combo meal. Enjoy the best cheeseburgers in town. Fries, tasty soda, life jam, you name it. Or better yet, make it a combo meal. Yeah, yeah, three orders, huh? Yeah, uh, I, I don't know, I can't ask. Okay, so you want four orders now. Baby machine, pork tasty soda, yay. The tables here are sticky. <sighs> I'm gonna join me with my friends. Um, nom, 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 nom. <laughs> oh, Mori sits there with his legs up. He still, he holds up to his knees even in the chair. Three bars are hoying away. To all those lost lovers out there, this one is for you. Ah, la la. La la la. La la la. La 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 la. La 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 Oh yeah I say la 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 again Yeah Yeah Oh I can move I do this for you Spires are entranced by their captain Look at him go He's so fucking beautiful Sing your heart out captain do it do it. Blah, 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 blah. All right, I'm getting the crap out of here. Uh, bah, must have left my smokestacks at home again. I don't even know, is that a fish or a robot? I can't even tell. Oh, it's longer than I thought it would be. That's gonna be a walk back to the start too. <laughs> Might as well keep going. That's right. Oh, hey, a fish house. Uh, a human, fish boy. Catching and raising fish is a hobby of mine. Passes time is mildly rewarding. Full of fish, but only the bones. Books about the many uses of fish, fish sauce, fish oil, and fish glue. There are also quite a few cookbooks. Fish Boy's futon smells like seaweed and vinegar. Little sea plants. Oh, fuck. This is my jam right here, baby. Bambi bambi lu do lu ba 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 la ba la 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 Okay. I'm all out, I'm all out of tuna in my brain. A colorful roulette, which I can't even fucking do anything with. Oh, I didn't even reach the start yet. Uh, I'll pay the toll, well sure. Why don't you spin the wheel for me? No. If you don't spin, you can't wait. God damn it. What? So say what class, some lucky number. Sure. No. What? What the fuck? Okay, it never ends. Does it ever end? So fall for you gotta take it. Oh, there we go. It does end. I, I didn't even actually do anything. I, I, yeah, I, I don't think I was actually continuously spending money. All right, good. I was like, fuck, dude, what the hell? So I'd be pissed the fuck off. Oh, what the hell? Oh, look what happened, Mr. Outback. He turned to stone or something. <laughs> Mr. Outback, what did they do to you? Mr. Outback has turned to sand. Or was he sand the entire time? Yep, so that's what happens. Well, I can never talk to him again. Piece of shit. Oh, there's the ghost. Beer ghost. Where, where is I going to take my memory and what it used to be? Okay, so we map to, map to beer ghost. Yeah, what you got there? Map to old top ass fighter. Well, who it sure is. I've been going for all the food gets cold. I come, all you can eat buffet. Okay. It's one in this area. Oh, hey, I can go in the water now. That's right. I forgot. Oh, God. That guy's over here. A red ribbon. Like the army. Uh, attack increases with more energy, defense plus five. A pretty red ribbon. Okay, if I remember correctly, I believe the ghost. There's a ghost over in the snowy area over here. 
Yep. Oh, this doesn't look right. I must take a wrong turn somewhere. Gay spooky mask to, or map to Sun Haggos. So map, oh my, it's even as top has to seal. I'll be able to get to the party. Thank you, children. Let's go down. I'm already behind schedule as it is. Burr, 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 burr. Oh, right. I've got a thing to redeem a snow cone or two. Oh, wait. No, do it over here. Heals a friend's hardened juice and raise all stats for the battle. Nice. Does it mean like heal it all the way? Oh, yeah. I can't open this. It's beneath a trap door. Is this is this where it is? Oh, it, oh, it needs batteries. I have yet to come across it. All right. I gotta go back to the forest and water the plants. Oh, I also need to check and see what uh, Basil's house looks like. Because I'm going to bet it looks a bit more sunk then than it did before, previously. Yep, looking a little dry. Looking a little thirsty. Yeah, so Basil's gives... Uh, ba Basil's, as well as his own plants, give Amori uh, hearts. So basically, Amori has two ways to get more HP. <gasps> oh my god, a cactus! It actually is thirsty! After 33 years! I didn't get any HP for it. Fuck you, game. All right, let's see what it looks like in here. Are more trees dead? I can't really tell, honestly. There's like trash in the lake. Flowers are dying. Uh-oh. There it goes. No, it's definitely, it's, it's looking worse in here. The floor is sinking. Small, small plants, they look a little sad. I hear music too. There's another one. Ah, uh, come on! Why did I have to go get lost again? Spooky map. Oh hi, uh, is this a map? Oh yeah, I can see top hat sealing it. My guy, this is the direction of the party. Thank you so much, guy stranger. Talk to you at the party. Okay, I think at least two more. Oh, I suppose this guy's still here. Pegaboo. Well, all right, guys. Uh, I think this is probably a good place to end things here for now. I think we've been going for a while, so we'll save getting the remainder of the ghosts and uh, hopefully finish off a few more of these uh, these side quests uh, for next time. Uh, but anyway, guys, I hope you all enjoyed this episode. If you did, please leave a like and a favorite and subscribe if you're not already become Picky Penguin. I'm more the SLP, where the days are always sunny and the vids are always funny. And as always, guys, till next time, stay classy.